typically if somebody sends in a pump uh, we receive it here it's logged into the system uh, the next step for that pump is to go to the teardown bench uh, where it's completely disassembled um, all components are uh, evaluated measured and logged onto a worksheet from there it goes to the estimating department where they'll estimate the repair send it to the customer and wait for approval on the pump uh, from there in order to expedite things we go straight to the dip tanks with it uh, pumps thoroughly cleaned and the dip tanks pulled out pressure washed uh, from there it goes to the sandblaster and it's taken down to bare metal from there put on the rack and once the PO is issued uh, the pump will come down to the technician's bench if it needs any machine work uh, those parts will be taken off that pallet and sent to the machine shop to have whatever necessary repairs are done uh, whether it's bore the cylinders uh, repair a bearing journal on the rotor or whatever it may need uh, once that work is done, the technician brings it back, uh, starts the assembly process with, you know, replacing all the consumables, bearings, seals, O-rings, and, you know, everything that's consumed on the pump in a normal repair. Uh, after the pump is completely assembled, uh, goes through testing, it, there's a separate bench where we test run the pumps, uh, bring them up to operating temperature, and do blank off testing on Once the pump passes test, uh, then it goes back to our paint booth and gets uh, the famous Bush Hammer Silver paint job done.